What are the, some of the conundrums feminists face in porn? I'm here with Jupiter Slut from jupiterslut.com, and I'm Kathy Vartili from theintimacydojo.com. And Jupiter, you're talking at Woodhull Sexual Freedom Summit on the conundrums faced by feminists in porn in a talk titled More Than Sexy. Um, can you tell us a little more about it? I'd be delighted to. Thank you. I uh, proposed this panel because... I myself am a feminist and I produce porn and I face conundrums as a feminist in in the industry. Yeah. I got into creating porn because I was working on my own issues around having had my entire sexual identity and, and sex life um, aimed at pleasing men. Mm -hmm. I was I was raised to uh, I was raised to please them sexually and otherwise, and I didn't know any other way to be. In my very first sexual encounters, I pretty much had an out-of-body experience. I kind of watched from the outside to observe what people would do with my body, and that was my sex ed. And after a 15-year marriage, um, I I had the kind of sex that my partner was willing to have with me, but there was a lot of kind of parts of my own sexual identity that wasn't expressed. Mm -hmm including the fact that my whole life I've been an exhibitionist and I've been suppressing that because that's not very acceptable. Yeah. So for me, it was a huge feminist move just to start making porn that was designed at showing and pursuing my sexual pleasure. Why did you choose Woodhull as a venue to share this on? Well, I've been attending Woodhull for about three years and it is a magnificent group of, of thinkers, activists, people who are looking to create more freedom and more love and more rights to our own sexuality. Yeah. And I've, I've benefited tremendously from listening to other speakers. And it was one of the first places that I ever experienced a publicly safe space for sexual inquiry and discussion. Mm -hmm. It's also pretty academic. It was a very high level of discussion and I have an academic background. Yeah. I have two master's degrees and I love, I love getting really nitty gritty in the conversation. So those are the things that are bringing me to Woodhull and I just, this is my first opportunity that I'm getting to, to give back to the community and I'm, I'm just thrilled. I love it. Thank you so much. Um, if someone wanted to learn more about feminists and around porn and the, the issues they face, is there any good place they can go to learn more? Well, you know, there is, there are, I would say if you, um, I have a, a book that I'm currently reading, uh, called watching porn. It is a memoir by a, uh, porn journalist after 10 years of being a female feminist porn journalist, uh, she wrote a memoir and I am learning a ton. I was in the industry, but it's easy to be in your niche or, or to not yeah. know the history or the breadth of the work that you're of, that other people are doing in the same vein as you. And I am learning so much by reading this memoir and loving it. So that's wow. nice. watching, so watching porn. porn. Great. by Lindsay G. That would be my like recommended book if you're interested in issues of feminism and porn. There are other good ones, um, which an Amazon search would do, but that one, I love that one. Thank you for and, the recommendation. Oh. Yeah. And thank you for, again, thank you for, like, I know it's really, it's challenging enough to do the, 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 the exploration of your own sexuality, what turns you on, but also considering, like, how does this fit in with my beliefs around feminism? And then not only examining that but distilling it and sharing it with people i really appreciate this and i think that you're adding a lot to the community so thank you for being part Happy. of this yeah all right um i look forward to see you in um, a couple months at woodhull and Yay. if you're watching this and you have questions or comments please leave them below we'll try to get back to you yeah and find me at jupiterslut.com